606 right now. That is your rush block, your news, weather and traffic in five minutes or less. A father and photographer grabbing headlines this morning after creating these images that look like back to school fashion ads featuring kids wearing bulletproof vests. They're not really real. Liza Lucas is watching the story closely for us from the bridge. Liza, what are people saying about this one? Sheba, they are certainly provocative and people are talking about them online. We've had a whole discussion this morning on our insider page. We're going to get to some of those comments shortly, but again, these ads aren't real, but these are real kids that are being featured in them. And so are the armored book bags and bulletproof vests the kids are wearing. Now, photographer Richard Johnson hopes they evoke real feelings and reactions, and he created the series working to make his art look commercial as can be. But the photos are personal and some feature his own kids who are in school and going through active shooter drills. Now, he says he came up with the idea for this series a year ago, and after recent mass shootings, he says he's just disappointed. They're just as relevant today. Now, he says his only goal is to cause real conversations, and he had a quote here, if you don't like them, do something about them, make these photos irrelevant. But we've been talking about the effectiveness of them and what resonating for many of our insiders this morning. Ricardo saying they started a conversation all right. Will it make us numb to the real topics of keeping our kids safe? And Larray also weighing in saying effective indeed. Hashtag perspective. Nikki also just tweeted at me. She brings up the point that it's not just schools where these vests might be considered. So she talks about churches and other places. So a real conversation starter being happening because of these photos. All right, Liza, thank you so much. Uh, you know, we've already been having this conversation now that we've seen um, sales increase for the bulletproof backpacks mm -hmm. and the inserts and that sort of thing. And I can see what this father's doing. He wants us to actually see what mm -hmm. it would look like with our kids going to school dressed like this with with the vest on and that sort of thing and I, I mean it, it it does look ridiculous in nature but it is our society now sadly and so the question is has it swayed you more by seeing these kids with the bulletproof vest that sort of thing to get them for for your kid some people may say it looks ridiculous. Mm -hmm. I say, go dad, go. Oh, I no. love seeing these images. The reason why, because it puts it in America's face. Do something about it. We continue to see our children get gunned down. We continue to see our, our, our colleagues get gunned down and nothing is done. All we do is hold vigils. Um, the president speaks about it and then there is no action that takes place. This father is now putting these images in the forefront, making people feel uncomfortable and forcing out these conversations. And this is the reality. We're actually yeah. selling, you know, they're selling these book bags. Yeah, oh, they're, yeah. Sell, they're yeah. already selling them. In fact, they they're sell doing the, really well. Yeah, they sell the plates too to put in the backpack that you, if you've already purchased it. I'm not going to get into a gun control debate with mm -hmm. you right now, but look, let's face it, after the Philadelphia situation, that dude was a felon. He had an arsenal, okay? Bad guys are going to get guns. We've got to protect the children. I know it's satirical. Mm -hmm. I think it's a great idea. Mm -hmm. Like you say, front and center. Put it in everybody's mind. Mm -hmm. I, I like it. I mean, um, you know, it's art. I look at it as art. I know it looks like a real ad or whatever the case may be, yeah. but thought-provoking, you know, make you think about uh, what it is we're doing with our young children. Mm -hmm. I like it. All right. Mm -hmm. One thing we need to know otherwise. Well,